I feel privileged and proud of myself. Hopefully it's gonna be a good show. Iga Sviantek has been unbeatable in her matches. Moreover, Wimbledon has announced that she will open play on the center court. Traditionally, defending champions open play on the center court, but due to some unwanted circumstances, they must find a replacement. Iga Sviantek seems very happy and feels honored to open the play. Welcome back to another video of Rally Rackets. In this video, we will talk about Iga Sviantek and how she is going to open play on the center court. What are her feelings and what does she think about her matches? Before we move forward, please subscribe to the channel and don't forget to press the bell icon so you don't miss any updates. Halep's Neck Injury Simona Halep won the Wimbledon tournament in 2019 and then the event was canceled due to COVID in 2020. In 2021, Simona Halep didn't play the tournament because of her calf injury, and Ash Barty was given the honor. So with Ash retired, Darren Cahill, who was the coach of Simona Halep in 2019, thinks that the honor should be given to Halep. Halep withdrew from her bad Hamburg semifinal match on Friday due to a neck injury. I apologize for having to withdraw today before my semifinal match, but unfortunately I awoke this morning with a blocked neck, which is preventing me from performing to my full potential. I've had a fantastic time here in bad Hamburg. Halep wrote on Instagram. Now, a few hours later, Wimbledon announced their decision and gave the privilege to Iga Sviantek. Iga Sviantek will open play on the center court. Iga has responded that she feels very privileged. She said, I know there are some discussions about who should open, and I feel very fortunate that I was chosen. It's fantastic for me. I mostly feel privileged and proud of myself. Hopefully, it will be a good show, she said. Iga Sviantek speaks to the media on the eve of the championships. She was asked by reporters, how did she find out that she is opening center court on Tuesday? Did she request that, or was it a surprise? Oh, we didn't ask for that. I know there was some debate about who should open, and I consider myself extremely fortunate to have been chosen. Many of the players here have won Wimbledon and had a fantastic tournament. Yes, it is a fantastic opportunity for me. That surprised me because I only made it to the fourth round last year, which was my best result. Now you all must be thinking, how is Iga going to handle the grass court? But it seems that she has now learned a lot and can handle the court very well. She reached the fourth round of Wimbledon last year and has played in the ladies singles at Wimbledon twice. She believes that she is becoming more adept at handling the intricacies of grass court tennis. She thinks she can take lessons from 2018 this week. Four years isn't a long time, she explained. However, that was probably the most important time in my career in terms of developing and discovering my game and learning how to do new things on the court. It seems like a different world, honestly. A lot has happened since then. I'm happy that I was able to reach every stage of the journey and not stop at any of it. She also said that she has improved a lot when reporters asked her, you're on this incredible unbeaten run. You're the big favorite. How can you translate your form onto the grass this year? She said, that is a difficult question. To be honest, I still don't understand grass. Last year for sure it was the type of tournaments in which I had no idea what to expect. Then, match by match, I realized I might be able to do more and more. Still, I only played on grass for about 10 days this year, so it's not a lot. I didn't have much time to prepare, but I'm just trying to stay positive and realize that I can play without any exceptions by remaining open-minded. I've had so many, I don't know, successes this season that I don't feel the need to show everyone that I need to play well in every tournament because tennis is full of ups and downs. So I try to go into this tournament with no expectations and just see what happens. Now we want to wish her all the best for her opening match and hope that she plays well on grass. Moreover, we wish that she maintains her winning streak. And we will be back with another video on another topic.